How's it going everybody? In today's video, I didn't pick up a storage unit, but instead I did go to a few estate sales. So I'm starting off with this multi-million dollar mansion, and there was nothing in that first garage, but whenever I came over here to the second garage, there was this absolutely beautiful red car. I do not remember what kind of car it was, maybe you can read doing? it there on the paperwork, doing well. but absolutely beautiful. I love the older cars, and it I mean, what more can you say? It just absolutely takes my breath away. This is actually the reason why I had come to this garage sale, was just to look at these signed guitars. They had, that one there on the left is Paul McCartney. They also had uh, one from Led Zeppelin, I believe they had ACDC, and they also had um, three or four other very popular bands. Uh, I don't remember what they were at the time, but absolutely beautiful, fantastic, probably one of the, my favorite things I've ever found. It's so good I had to take a picture and send it to my friend who's a huge Beatles fan. Continuing on, this is the living room. I just love how open this living room is, how they have the floor to ceiling windows, and that balcony there is fantastic too. So we're going to go ahead and continue on downstairs here. Hey, how are you? Good. How about yourself? So continuing on downstairs, I didn't really find anything, but continuing on, they do have this awesome eight-person home theater, which I thought was fantastic. They also had a home gym, and I had to see myself in the mirror, because that was cool, you know, why not? We're going to continue upstairs here, and at the top of the stairs, you get to see another beautiful view of that living room and those windows, which I just absolutely love. So I didn't end up purchasing anything at that first estate sale, but we are going to continue here to the second estate sale that I went to. Morning. Now I immediately went downstairs and this person also had a lot of musical type stuff. It looks like they had a recording studio of some sort. Now, as I was about to leave the basement, I looked to my left and I found this wine cellar slash gun safe area, and I just had to go and check it out. Now, while I was waiting to get behind the counter there, I actually did find these two Glock magazines, not clips, magazines. And I looked them up, and it looked like they did pretty well. I ended up purchasing both of them for a total of $15 because they were 25% off. Now, this is the last estate sale that I went to today. Hello. Hello. Good morning. How, How are, you? are you? Good. How about yourself? We're fabulous. We've got three floors to inspire you. I will do my best. <laughs> And just as a side note, I'm glad they put that blue tape there because I definitely would have hit my head on the ceiling. Now, they had the prices kind of weird, but they did have a few good records, Elvis Presley, Neil Diamond, um, but they were just priced too high for me to make any money, so I passed. They also had um, some old vintage Hot Wheels and Barbies as well. But similar to the records, they were overpriced, so I ended up passing on them as well. Do you have a price on this? Do you know if everything's in here? I have no idea. That is 125 each. 125. Oh, okay. I thought that was 12. Um, and I'm not sure what's all supposed to come in there. Okay. Is it okay if I take it? Yes, please. There's 90, 30, 75. So he's missing some of the original stuff, which you paid for. I was thinking. Let's do 85. Okay. I can do 85. Okay. Cool. Alright, so I don't know how much of that I caught, um, but I did end up buying this D&D &D set for uh, $85. The base set I do not believe is complete, however it does have 
like three or four different modules in there. Um, so I should be able to make a decent profit on that. I might I might sell everything for 200, but I mean, as a Dungeons and Dragons fan, <laughs> when are you gonna find a base set like this, you know? So even though it's beat up, I still had to buy it just, just because I'm a nerd, you know? So, all right, let's keep going. And then I didn't go to any more estate sales, but rounding off the day, I did stop at Goodwill and I found these pair of shoes that I'm gonna list for 50. So if you guys liked, Go ahead and subscribe, please. Thanks.